What's going on, guys? Welcome to another Modern Cube Draft. Probably the very last Modern Cube Draft we'll be doing. After this, it'll be Dominaria. So be sure to check out the channel, youtube.com slash Frank Lepore, for uh, all the Dominaria drafts. This one's going to be a stipulation. Uh, it's just a random one. We just decided to do it right now. Mike is going to make all the picks in this draft. So I'm leaning towards Hornet Queen. I will, not, I will not confirm or deny your picks. You just tell me when you've picked, when you've decided. Hover that Hornet Queen. Yeah, I like Hornet Queen. All right. Hornet Queen. Hornet Queen. It's like Mississippi Queen, but, you know, with hornets instead. It's much more deadly. It's a deadlier Mississippi Queen. I I never let Mike play because he's just not good at controlling. We'll time out. It's not a me thing. It's a, it's a, It just makes me feel bad when you guys say stuff like that because it's literally not an issue of, like, me. I'm not denying him playing. It's just a comfort thing. Elspeth. It's a technical technical proficiency thing. That's your final answer? Mm-hmm. All right. Mike, don't mess this up now. Mike, don't fudge this up, Mike. <laughs> don't do it, man. Gotta talk hmm. through these picks, man. I don't know. I'm bad at it. Like, God, you know how you get better at things? You do them. It's called practice, and you you stream constantly. These people love you, man. I think it's just disallow. Yeah, you gotta go. You gotta triple green, double double white, double blue. It's up to you, man. I think it's disallow. Dang it! Oh wait, <laughs> dang it! I messed up. Uh, the world is your oyster, man. Uh, I'm going to hover over Phantasmal Bear. That's, that's what terrible. you get. That's what uh, you get if you don't pick in time. Let's go with Vendillion Click. Too late, it's Bear. Okay. Do you want Please don't. Vendillion Click? Yeah. Oh, Crypto Command, get rewarded, <laughs> boy! Yeah, take that. Okay, so Whirler Road. No, no! <laughs> I just picked a four-drop blue card, man. I got confused. It's close, it's fair. Uh, where is your reward where is your reward now unknown j08 i will be going to a midnight pre-release this weekend it will be in arkansas though so uh yes and uh yes all right that's all i got the end i like a hamiri angel children no imprisoned in the moon close okay Reflector me. So you're just drafting the same deck I drafted last draft. <laughs> well, it's open. It's not the same. There's different cards in it. Yeah, Hornet Prince Queen. Command. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Literally still, Hornet Queen. still be green, blue. This would be much better if your faces were surgically attached to dog body. <laughs> what? <laughs> I think you're right. I don't think you're wrong. If someone wants to... Um, Photoshop some dog bodies that I can put in the overlay underneath our heads. Uh, knock yourself out. I will use them. Pilgrim's Eye. That's a good choice. I would have picked that too. You did real good, Michael. I'm real proud of you, buddy. I watched a documentary on clams that turned people undead. Well, that's a thing. What? What? Should I should I go over here and like and talk real quiet so that Mike doesn't know what I'm saying and then I can make fun of him and make fun of his picks? I can hear you. Okay, he says he can hear me, but he can't hear me, so should I do that? <laughs> oh my god. Oh boy. Look, you ran out of time. You got you got pilgrim's eye, too bad. It took too long. Dang. Seinfeld or Friends? That's not a question. Literally Seinfeld. Not even close. I don't Se even like Friends. Seinfeld is a 10 and Friends is like a 3. It's not even in the same ballpark. Dungeon Mongoose. Dungeon Mongoose? Mm-hmm. Hornet Nest? No. Oh, you want to play the Hornet theme deck? <laughs> yes. Okay. 
That's exactly what I want. Um. Okay, yeah, Santa Clarita Diet is not a is definitely not a documentary, and I've actually been meaning to watch that because it has Timothy Oliphant, and I'm actually a huge Timothy Oliphant fan ever since watching uh, Justified, and pretty much anything else he's done, he's just great. Um, but yeah, so yeah, so Seinfeld are friends. It's like it's like saying, hey, would you rather have the best food in the world that was ever created, or um, a relatively mediocre food that has some? Uh, it's it's kind it's of like okay. A standard cheeseburger. Yeah, and I'd be like, well, the best food ever ever really sounds like really what I'm looking for here. Mm, battle ball. Hmm, not the direction I would went there, but all right. A barrel. Yeah, because you already have cryptic and disallow. Meh. Sensor, get him. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, I would have taken the gate there. Let the record show. Bear boy. Bear boy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> would have probably taken shrine. Oh man, I'm so I'm really surprised you took sensor over negate. Like negate is such a good counter spell in this format. Meh. Okay. You have to work on your mic drops. That's that's amazing. Someone commented on the mic dropping ice video, and he's like, you got to work on your mic drops. That's actually hilarious. Insignificant. Okay, we got to pick something. Oh, it doesn't matter. I'm not playing any of these cards. I mean, you could splash this guy. It's very easy if you get the right nah. card. Okay, I don't know why. Why no? Nah. Okay, why no? Because it's not that easy to splash. If you get a Temple Garden and like two fetch lands, it's totally easy to splash. It's one green. It's like the. It's literally how. It's it's literally. Did you hear me? It's very hard to be friends with sometimes, guys. I'm gonna be real right now. It's it's very difficult to chat to have a conversation with him. You're also getting a lot of good red cards and not very many good white cards, so you should keep that in mind. Like you we just have passed one good red card. You also passed the Hellrider, which was in the insignificant pack, and uh, a Shrine of Burning Rage, which we took Phantasmal Bear over. Mm -hmm. So that's at least three good red cards, and I'm pretty sure there's a red card in the last pack too. Hmm. <laughs> it's up to you. It's up to you. I think. Like, honest reply only, did you cry more during Armageddon or Titanic? Armageddon, obviously. <laughs> I feel that, man. I get that. I think it's Jay Spillerin. Actually, oh, I kind of like Bloodline Keeper here. Just throwing out the white. There's a little Snapcaster Mage. I don't mm. even see a Jay Spellerin in this pack. Sorry, bro. I think it's Snappy. Yeah, take Snappy. That's the right choice. I'm glad you did that. You already got Cryptic Command Disallow and Sensor. You did good. I'm proud of you. I'm actually gonna put all your cards in the main deck, and then wow. you, and then you're gonna decide what you're getting cut. Oh, I gotta me. build it too. No. You know what? Yeah, you gotta build it too, man. I can't build your deck. Come on. Well, Guy, really... guys, he was gonna he was gonna get rid of Elspeth and, and play Bloodline Keeper, just randomly. You got Wrath of God. I'm glad you didn't do that. Supreme Will. Mm-hmm. The card, oh. Supreme Will. Oh, literally right in front of you. I know. I wasn't looking. Hmm. I think this is. <laughs> I think this is a good Hornet Queen deck, actually. If you get Flooded Grove and uh, what's the white one? Is the white one not in here? Actually, just take Colonnade. It's a good choice. Great Merchant is the pick. It's not. It's sour temptation. Sour? Yeah. Like uh like like a like a sour patch kid? Yeah. Like a sour of temptation patch kid? Mm-hmm. Okay. So I was just told I oh, hold on. 
I was just told, I just, so I just told my wife Mike's full name was Mike Barbobbly Boo, to which she replied, more like your mom, Blue. <laughs> wow. Oh, that's wonderful. Also, that's not his real name. Just so you guys, I hope you guys know Mike Barbobbly Boo is not his real name. Man, Affleck was the bomb in Phantoms, yo. Wow, that's old school. What is that, mall rats? So recently, me and both my roommates all broke up with our significant others. Wow. So we went out to get drunk at this restaurant, and the food was terrible, and they were blasting Armageddon from multiple scenes at full volume. From multiple screens at full volume, and it was so bad, and our souls were so crushed that we couldn't stop laughing, and they had to ask us to leave because we wouldn't stop making fun of Ben. Aww. Nimble obstructionist. Okay. New stipulation. You have to say all the cards in a British accent. That's... Nimble obstructionist. That wasn't a British accent. I don't know what that was. I don't know what that, that was, was either. I was just going to let it go, but... Nimble obstructionist. All right. New... All right. Now you're... New, new pick, governor. The pick is Gilded Lotus. Gilded Lotus? Mm -hmm. Okay. Michael is quiet. He lives. Oh, see, also, you can play Hornet Queen now because you get triple green off this. What problem is? I guess there's no problem. Um, scattered Groves, I guess. Scattered Groves, huh? That's almost a land you can cast your Crystal Pride Mage off of. Almost. Interesting. Aether Adept, please. <laughs> I'm sorry, what did you say? Okay, so the, the simulation is not Mr. Ed. It's a British person. It's a British accent. The pick is Aether Aether. I think you know how British I'm, I'm people... the chicken Sunday accent. Every... No, that's not... Every the... adept is Aether Aether. All right. Let's... It's Aether Adept, it is. I accept. I would have also taken Karanos there, to be to be honest. But now every day is either adept. Every adept is either adept. So what are you gonna do? Ulamog. Sunday chicken Sunday. You want Ulamog here? Actually, Charlie Course. Okay. <laughs> oh man, I changed his mind because I said it so incredulously. I was like, Ulamog here. And then he was like, dang it, I messed up. You can splash that Karanos off that Sulfur Falls. Nah, opt. Well, you're not... Yeah, obviously, you didn't take the Karanos. He'll come back. No, he won't. Eh, it'll be fine. No, it won't. Take old Tassiger. Take old Tassiger. Okay, old Tassiger it is. You just passed me. I was in that pack, Michael. Yeah, well, you're worth nothing to me, so... <laughs> Dang. Got him. He did. Disenchant. He, he did. He got me. I can't actually argue with that. Every day is Michael Sunday. Mimic that. Night of... Medrugrain? It doesn't sound very British. Night of Medrugrain. I, I don't think you've ever actually heard a British person in your life, to be quite honest with you. I can't do it. Shut up. I don't think you're even trying. Are you sure? You sure say you can't do things, Alana? I can't do this. I can't do that. I can't do this. I can't do you that. You tell me what to do. I, no, I didn't. I I'll didn't. sit, 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 sit on you. <laughs> no, I didn't tell you what. I didn't, I didn't say anything. I didn't tell you anything what to do. Look at this 30-card deck, man. Yeah, it's coming together beautifully. Dude, what are we cutting from it? Everything. Okay. It's weird, but your choice. <laughs> All right. 
Put them back. Oh, oh, you changed your mind, <laughs> did you? Okay. I did. You're yeah, not so fancy now, are you, governor? What you gonna do? This draft is a mess. <laughs> <laughs> This draft is a uh, mess. Glacial Fortress. Upgrade Brigade. Thank you so much for the sub. Welcome to the Salt High Brood. Really appreciate the support. Glacial Fortress? Mm-hmm. Okay, Gristlebrand? No. You can almost cast it with this. I just want you to be... Almost. Be... You're right. Almost. Glacial Fortress. Yes. I'm going to put it into your pack. Okay. Thank you. It's pronounced bokeh. Funny joke. Your Clever pick. impersonator. Kiki Jiki. Kiki Majiki. Lemon Squeezy. <laughs> okay, sure. You win. I'm going to take it. Are you okay with that? It's what I asked you to pick. This so is your life now. I just want you to be sure. Yeah. I'm okay with it. Unbelievable. Mike, what are you going to do? I sit on you. <laughs> I sit, sit, sit. I sit on you. God, I don't know. Um. Kira the Great Glass Spinar. Final answer. Final answer. Survey says Kira the Great Glass Spinner. Michael, you have 56 seconds. Make your pick. Talrand. Final answer. Yes. Talrand. Okay. Michael, you have 51 seconds. Jace, Architect of Thought. Make your pick. Sorry. Jace. No, I can't do it. <laughs> it's impossible. Okay, I don't know if it's impossible. It's impossible. I think you're just mono blue at this point, man. Jace, Architect of Thought. Michael, please make a pick in a timely fashion. That floaty guy. You guys seem to have so much fun, and so is chat. We should have one mic draft a week. Okay, we can do that. The floaty guy? All right, Trigon Predator. No. Oh. Yeah. No, wait. Take Perilous Mirror. That's better. Perilous Mirror. Mm -hmm. Michael? Uh, is that your final answer? Yes. Michael, can you say final answer? Final answer. Chicken Sunday. Michael, I need you to pick a card. You have if I don't want to. 40 seconds, please. Michael, 40 seconds, please. Take Mind Stone. Michael, I'm going to take the Mind Stone. Are you sure this is what you want? Mm-hmm. I'm going to put it in the pack. Take the Mind Stone. Okay, Mind Stone has been selected. Chicken Sunday. Michael, you have... 36 seconds. Please select a card now. Condemn. Yeah. No wait. Day of Judgment. 25 seconds. No wait. 20 seconds, Michael. Yeah, Condemn. Condemn has been highlighted. Michael, you have 10 seconds. I asked you to select Condemn. Five seconds, Michael. <laughs> okay. Okay. And please put your pencils down. Make sure all your answers are fully bubbled in and bold. And Michael, you have 30 seconds. Begin. Michael, did you hear me? I need confirmation that you heard me. Please Blaine's say. Yes. Please say. Please say. Please say please confirmation. Say, please say copy. Copy. Okay. Take the stinking blade slicer. Uh, Michael, your pick is blade splicer. Over. Over. Okay, I'm going to highlight the Blade Splicer, Michael. Please tell me if that's your, your selection. That is my final answer. You have four seconds, Michael. Please take that card. Okay. <laughs> you know, kijiki jiki. Let's do it. Uh, Michael, Let's order, for it. you want... <laughs> I mean, you got the Gilded Lotus. I don't know what problem is, buddy. I'm going to take Kajiki Majiki mm -hmm. and put him in your pile as your... I did call him that once, didn't I? Yeah. That's why you're... That's why... That's why it's Mike is not showing. Oh, there it is. What's your pick, man? You got 10 seconds. Nine, eight, seven, six. What? 
Uh-oh. There's no pick. Shellback Isle came back. Woo! This card's actually great in your deck. You have a bunch of Dirtles, like either Isle and what? Blade Splice. You can sacrifice the three, the one one. Take that Shellback Isle before I slap you. <laughs> wow. Take that stupid puppeteer click. Michael, uh, you have 12 seconds, 15 I have seconds. One second. Michael, I need you to concentrate, please. Michael, are you there? Oh, Wake Thrasher. Getting getting waked. Michael, you have three what seconds. What the hell is that card? It's a thriving grub. <laughs> what the hell is that Why card? Why is that in the cube? Why are you in the cube? I Yo. would like you to please cut. This card's great in your deck. I don't know why you didn't pick this guy more. Like, all the green have... cards. Okay, all the green cards. Yeah, please cut all the green cards. Elder's Evolution. Uh-huh. Kasali Pride Mage. Uh-huh. Hornet Queen. Uh huh. Now cut all the black cards. Scattered Grove. Wander. Now all the red cards. All right, that's your deck. (laughs) Now cut the lands. Okay. Yeah, crap. Now I gotta make more decisions. (laughs) God dang it. This is why I hate magic. You can cut the Phantasmal Bear. Okay. That's it, huh? That's your end? No, I'm not done. <laughs> Should I make up. this a little bigger for you? You can cut the mimic that. Scattered Grove is not a green card. Touche. You can cut the Wake Thrasher. But he's woke. More like Woke Thrasher, am I right? You can cut the Maloku. Oh, dang. Get wrecked, Maloku. You can cut the Disenchant. Okay. Knight of Metagrow. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. This deck's looking pretty mono blue right now. I don't know what else to cut. I like them all. Well, you got three more cuts to make, buddy. I guess... I guess cut Kira? The Great Glass? Shakira! Is there there more than one Kira? There might be. No, Michael. Mike B making decisions at half the speed of an elderly man lost in the aisles of a poorly lit CVS. (laughs) That was very specific. That was. It's like he's... It's almost like he's come across this scenario before. Hmm. Mary Angel, I guess. I can see. I can see at least two other things that are pretty easy cuts, but I can't help you. Shut your mouth. I am. I'm. I, I'm not gonna say anything. Uh, you can cut Battle Ball. And this is probably the deck. Huh. A little battle ball is pretty good with Guild of Lotus. Or Clever Impersonator. Alright, bring him back in. Okay, battle ball is back in the game. Um. Oh. Blade Splice is not too great here. You probably cut the Blade Splice. Yeah, I stutter. What about this guy? We have quite a few instant sorceries. We have like four. That's pretty much it. Alright. I guess we can get to Alaran. What is Gilded Lotus even for? You tap it, it adds three mana of any color to your mana pool. <laughs> 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 uh... Got him! Did you? Did you got him? I don't know. Well, this is probably the deck. I agree. I think this is good. Now I gotta play this monstrosity. This actually doesn't look too bad. But boy, does he... 11 islands, huh? 
and three planes. Wow. We have three blue cards in the three white cards in the deck. <laughs> Still, that seems wrong. Really, five white sources and uh, a Gilolos? I'd like more than that. Yeah, that seems better. So this is nine. This is twelve blue and seven white. That seems good. I wish we had some more card draw though. We got charter course. <laughs> Snapcaster charter course. That's actually not terrible if you do get to attack. Which is, I mean, our deck has thirteen creatures plus clever impersonator as a guy. Yeah, whatever. We'll be drawing. Well, we're, we won't have to discard it thus. I'm pretty sure. It just gives you mana. It's just mana. It lets you activate Colonnade and still keep up counter spells. It lets you play it and still keep up a counter spell. Hand seems a little rough. Like most of the time when you play Gilded Lotus, you play it on five and it gives you three. So that's eight mana. You untap, play your six land. So it gives you nine mana. You're not usually playing nine mana things off of Gilded Lotus. It just gives you mana. It's just a great card. What are you saying right now? You give me this? No. Oh, I thought I was like, oh yeah, this hand seems fine. And what you like this hand? Yeah, I think this hand's fine. It's got cryptic command. What do you? What more do you want? It's got six lands. It's in a it. blade splicer. It's fine. It was a snapcaster, but it's still very good. Oh my god. Well, to be fair, you're the one piloting, so you do you. I did. I did me. I made the deck. <laughs> you sure did. I made the deck. <laughs> you sounded like a. Like a three-year-old who just, who got his, who, who, who had, I just put his, birth... shut up. <laughs> Who's the three-year-old now? Wow. He played a city of brass and then played a dark covenant. Man, he's going to lose so much life. That's aggressive, dude. God, every day's chicken Sunday for this guy. That's for sure. Sunday, chicken Sunday. Cool mug. No, oh, it's a Gideon's law keeper. I guess they're just like, hey man. Two is the top, so. Two is the top. I'm tempted to sower this dark confidant, to be quite honest with you. Well, oh, you boy. have to wait two more turns. Oh, to do boy, it. huh? If you attacks, it might be worth just snapping. I was thinking that, too, actually. But boy, do I like having double cryptic, man. But we have to survive until then. I'm pretty sure we're just blocking. Ambush Viper! I was saying that there are cards that are always good. I mean, sure. Sometimes certain cards are not good, right? But this hand has two cryptic commands. What problem is, man, do I agree with you? Uh, if you hadn't lingering souls, I probably wouldn't have blocked. No, because we wouldn't, we wouldn't, uh, like they could just have any removal spell. I only want to run out Snapcaster for either getting value off of it or killing a Dark Confidant, so. Hunter. It's only, it's literally, I never Stop. hear him licking ever. It's only when we're streaming, so it's very funny. God, Hunter, how are you going to be? I'll play my Gideon's Law Keeper. My Gideon's Trapper Keeper. Oh, no, you're not going to play that guy. Okay. Well, that's annoying. Actually, can I just steal that guy? Hmm. I think we're going to steal that guy. Sunday, chicken Sunday. Now your creature's coming to play tapped. <laughs> That was a diabolical laugh. You're a diabolical. Huh. Yeah, didn't think of that, didn't No, I, that's a good point. That's a real good point. I had not thought of that. Thank you. You're welcome. Just kidding. No, you weren't. Dang it. How'd you get so... How'd you get so smart? I went to smart school. I knew it. I was going to go to smart school when I was young. Should have. Went to stupid school. Oh, terrible move. Worst decision of my life. Sunday, chicken Sunday.
You okay, man? You fall asleep? Your narcolepsy is real strong right now. Do you like being able to keep opt up and cryptic commando? It's all right. I wonder what we do here. Sunday chicken Sunday. I'm so used to watching other teams. I forgot we're alive and someone to pause the video. <laughs> God, I love that. Oh my God, that's the best. Is our reflector mage this guy? They're just gonna tap down this and keep attacking for four. Mm -hmm. Or we can giddy, we can dungeon geist this guy. That seems good, right? Yeah. That's chicken Sunday all over again. In response, they kill this. So there's battlefield tapped. That did not happen. So all right, that's pretty good. Watch this. Hey, Frank. Frank and Mike, this guy needs to go rock a pee. Could you just stay real still and not say anything for a minute? Thanks. <laughs> Nailed it. Okay, hold on. I'm kind of okay with this because it's still on our opponent's time. So, Okay. I wonder how awkward that looked. I wonder if there are people who are like, oh god, the video actually did stop. Mm, that's pretty rude. I, I don't think I don't think that's very mature. Very mature. What kind of person does that on Chicken Sunday? Of all the days to do Of that. all the days you do it on Chicken Sunday? Come on. I mean, messed up, right? It's real messed up. I'm just trying to live my best life, my best chicken Sunday life, and then you're going to do that. Get my back up against the wall. going to block a spirit. Put it in the trash can. No one was like that because Michael immediately leaves an ear-numbing burp. Yeah, that's... <laughs> I don't know why he burps into the mic like it's... Uh, yeah, you got it. You got everything. No, people love it. Oh, they have it. no they don't why love do you it. oh my god why love love no oh did she just die she just dies right because yeah she just dies god, i still don't want to put her on the bottom it's still fine we can just play reflector mage vendillion click bounce this guy so they can't play it next turn Back up again. And if they attack with all of these, we'll just V-click this guy. Maybe. Sunday, chicken Sunday. I was born on a chicken Sunday. A fine day. I'm so used to watch live stream now that when I when I watch the clip on YouTube when I'm at work, I just try to join the chat and type, and then I get sad and mad. Oh my god. This is just terrible. Yeah, that guy's pretty good. My mine is beta. Yep, that's pretty cool. That's pretty scary. Wow. How did they do that? Interesting. Sunday, chicken Sunday. Have you thought of the chicken farmers that suffer your appetite for poultry? Day? No, because it's every day. It's so hard. You're gonna tap my dude. God, this one lingering souls is really causing us some some grief here. I will look at your things. Tetsamok. Yeah, I can't remember about opposing ancient than Tetsamok. Imposing sovereign, not imposing ancient. That's not his name. Imposing agent. He never move. 
He never move. All right, so you got that in a Tetsamok. Cool. Oh, that's interesting, isn't it? Isn't it? Hey, it's interesting, isn't it? Hmm. We could copy Soren. Uh huh. Doesn't do much though, I guess. Could make a vampire. How are we not dead here? We just literally have to keep up cryptic command here. I think we're pretty dead. Shut up, Michael. We could copy Reflector Mage, bounce another spirit, go to two. Copy Vendillion click doesn't work, it's legendary. Just don't want to die to spirits. That's all. Is that, all. is that too much to ask for? Yes. We can tap their team and bounce a spirit. Sunday, Jagan Sunday. Yeah, that's fine. Just got to keep this up, I guess. Keep it up. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. <laughs> Don't do it, man. Why do you do this? I too much. I like too much. What is this? A Tetsumok? Are you going to... You got big tets. My uncle kind of died from spirits. His liver gave up on him. Wow. Oh my god. Every time. Let's hit a condemn off this. That'd be great, right? Be decent. It was an island. It's not the same. Chicken Sunday strikes again. Sunday chicken. Su I actually like the attack for five, and then but then like it's hard to like. I mean, we tap their team down. They play Tetsamok. We knew they had Tetsamok in hand, so that wasn't a viable option. So they just have a blocker for this guy. We would play this and copy their Soren. We make an emblem. We'd have four, five, six, seven on board. Eight. Actually, it would be three, and f we'd actually put them to eight, and the Sorman emblem would actually put them to one. So, uh, if okay, so if we attack for five, they would have went down to eight. If we cryptic command their team, they go, they they play a guy post combat. Even if they don't, we get a Soren emblem and we attack for three, four, five, six, seven. They go to one. So nothing about that is actually correct, unfortunately. Profane Orvis, good seeing you. Thank you for the sub and the bits. Nope, we are dead. Did you tap with Cryptic after the declared attackers? No, I drew a card and I bounced the spirit. That's why we're at one. All right, 
infinite one one flyers what are we against by that nonsense not much mm -hmm. the mirror angel seems okay here not a big vendillion click fan when that's the case Uh, I wonder if Maloku's real good here, actually. Yeah. I like Maloku better than Talrand, because at least if you Maloku, you can probably get a couple guys off of it, whereas Talrand... Let's just bring in all the creatures that make other creatures. Now I can actually see Cutting Lotus, because we just have better things to do now. Also, Jace Architect. I think our deck is fine against them. We have Jace Architect of Thought. We have Maloku. We have Amiria. We have a ton of ways to... Oh, Vendillion Click is a fine cut because it's just a 3-1 that trades with their 1-1s. One I want to add some more white. I'll add one more white. That's all you get. Okay? Don't ask again. Hmm. I can see Knight of Meadowgrain even. First Strike and Lifelink? It's double white though, early. Oh, we just add more white. Just add more white, Mike. What problem is, Bruddy? Bruddy? Bruddy. Uh, Mimic Fat's not great because you don't have a way to kill their creatures. Their creatures either get exiled or put on the bottom or trapped in things like Journey to Nowhere. It's really hard for the blue-white deck to control what creatures die. Like, I don't think any creature in, in, the, in that, those two matches actually died except for, I don't know, whatever they killed to Slaughter Pact and Disfigure, I guess. But, I mean, like, tapping a guy down or gaining control of a guy for one turn with Mimic Vat is not the greatest, but. I mean, Mindstone and Cryptic Command is fine if we had all blue sources, but not the case. Leading off a City of Brass, a bold strategy. Indeed. Are you getting tired? Yeah, a little bit actually. You've only been up. You've been awake for eight hours now, man. I understand. Yeah, I know. Makes sense. I can I can see why you'd be tired. Oh, the old knight's whisper. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we'll just play that. What are we gonna get? What's it gonna be? It's gonna be four islands. You ready? <laughs> eh. Oh, Elder Deep Fiend off of this seems good. So does Jace, though. Yeah, I'll take the Elder Deep Fiend. I got an MTG commercial on my way to watch Frank play MTG. Nice. Nice. I did <coughs> Actually, I have no control over that. So, here, we'll wake Mike up a little bit. Oh. There you go. Give him a little spritz. They've already taken four damage from the City of Brass, right? No, two from two and two? God, oh, the Lingering Souls again? Unbelievable. <laughs> you laughing at that hunter? Yeah. I think it's just Reflector Mage here. I'm fine with bouncing one of these guys as soon as I can. Was that the Hunter Repeller you used on Mike? No, there's no Hunter Repeller. I would never repel Hunter. He's too wonderful. Mike, it's however. For the cat. No, for the cat, you get like a jar of, of uh, pennies, and then you shake it, and they... Is that a real thing? Uh, Like, it's supposed to stop. Like, if dogs are barking, they get scared at like a jar of pennies, like an old soda bottle full of pennies, and you just shake it because they don't like the sound. Really? I never knew that. How to change? It's a shake can. Okay, jar of pennies was a terrible idea. Oh, um, maybe it's not a good thing. I don't know. It's probably one of those controversial things. I personally don't do it, so I don't have any kind of shakers for my pets. But I don't got any shakers for my pets. Say man. That's good. I like that. I like it when you say, "Water your dog, or else it will not grow to its full size." That's true. You do have to water your dog. 
I'm just going to draw two cards next turn. Is that okay? It's all right. It's all right. It's okay. okay. All right. It's okay in mysterious way. What? Oh, we got a disfigure? What if I counter your disfigure and then bounce your guy? That's pretty cool, right? Sure. Got him. Every day is Chicken Sunday. Sunday, Chicken Sunday. This is what I'm saying, man. This is what I'm saying. Water your dog also not grow to full size. All these things, yeah, we were, we got that one. All right. Little Spritz is actually Mike's rapper name. Uh, it's Little Spritzy. <laughs> oh, my bad, my bad. <sighs> now I'm yawning. Why you got me yawning, bro? You did this to yourself. Yeah, you're right. They you signed up for long. I'm sorry, did you say something? No. <laughs> I think you had a stroke, though. <laughs> <laughs> Every day's chicken Sunday. Oh, God, he, won't, he just won't stop saying it. It's unbelievable. Marsh flats. God. The rich get richer, am I right? No. <laughs> look, 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 Hunter, stop. Scramble. Hunter, leave that box alone. Bob, 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 Hunter, you have been fed. Never repel. He's so amazing. He really is, though. He's wonderful. He's the biggest cutie that's ever lived. Is our opponent taking significantly? Like, they have three minutes less. That's not a terrible amount less, but it's enough less that I feel like they're really being deliberate here. Yeah. You know the drill. We're blocking. Why can't it be Thick Boy Thursday? It could be. Ain't nobody stopping that. Do I want this guy? No. I don't care. Puts my back up, puts my back up against the wall. Thick boy, thick boy Thursday. Wow. What? It was amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Love your concept for following you since CGP Player Days and your articles and videos helped me learn and grow as Magic Player when I was starting out. I had the pleasure of meeting you at Pro Tour with the Gatewatch. My friend and I accidentally matched shirts like idiots. First time catching a live stream, so I figured to sub. It's the absolute least I could do to show my appreciation. Thanks for Thank you so much, man. Really appreciate it. Upgrade Brigade. Thank you, buddy. Appreciate that. Also, sub comment delay because I had to go verify my email. <laughs> I accept. Oh, this is where they kill our Blade Splicer and then they block here. And I think that's actually, I don't really want you to do that. Encounter it. I guess. Nice. The Corgi puppy overlay is not complete, but I guarantee it's going to be incredible. I'm trying to make sure your memes are not dreams. Why is Mike B as a chicken not just posted everywhere? Next time Mike B is coming to Arkansas too. All right. Well, that is fine. All of this is okay. Brian, thank you so much, buddy. Appreciate it. I like that Brian just communicates through donations. My dog for some reason seems trying to share the couch with me and ends up clinging to a small strip instead of using the lower third by my feet. I don't even know what that means. 
Look at that, planes. The rich get richer, man. I just wanted to say your articles and videos made me a worse player in person. Oh, that's really sad. There's a Kappa. I know. Also, Pack One Pick One's been here. I, I, I know. I know the Jokers. I think Even you bounce the splicer instead of drawing another three three is better than a random. Um. Meh. Every day is Chicken Sunday. God, they're at nine right now because of the stupid thing. Good lord. I just wanted to say my name is Jeff. That's my good. name is Jeff. I just got him off the my hey, name is Jeff. That's pretty good. Did you ever? Did, have you? Did you ever really get me off of my name is Jeff? No. I don't think so, man. Kerwin, top of the screen, bucks. <laughs> Thank you so much, man. Appreciate. I now know the source of that gif. Yeah. Well, you knew it was Parks and Rec, but now we we just saw the episode the scene, yeah. where that gif uh that gif made an appearance like the other day. Oh my god, really? This is aggressive. I think they're just trying to get rid of their dark confidant. I will take two. It's actually pretty good here. Not bad. I'm one, two, three, four, five. I am gonna opt first just to see if we can hit something to deal with this idiot, but No. Oh! Is that good enough? Oh, we're actually at 20. We can, like... We can either add up to this guy and then flash this bad boy in. That seems good, right? Sunday, chicken Sunday. Do you I mean, want to bounce the Tetramon? I want to get in. I want to deal the damage. Do you just bounce the Nighthawk instead? Like, if we bounce this guy, we get to deal three, right? And that seems good. Yeah, it just makes it better. So they go to six here. I also have Colonnade too. So, like, we just EOT Elder, Elder Deep Fiend here. Tap all their things. God, they just keep... They just keep getting richer. I usually watch on YouTube and often find myself wanting to comment and chat. One of these days you'll be streaming live at the same time. And I'll just appear in your chat and start talking about something that happened a week ago. I wouldn't be surprised if that did happen. About a week ago. They played Swamp, so they have Swamp. They have Tetsamok. I think we play the Plains. I mean, I don't care. If they just go Tetsamok, whatever, we can actually just tap down all their things and attack with Colonnade and Moloku. So. It's cast. You know, play the Exiled card without paying its mana cost. It's the same thing, right? I think it's a cast trigger. Yeah, but cast and play are the same term. They're just used interchangeably in magic. It doesn't say cast from your hand, right? No, it's just when you cast this spell. I guess we'll find out. On Chicken Sunday. Seven mana. Ruinous path. Okay, well, that's actually fine. <clears throat> cast yeah see it's a cast trigger <laughs> it's already tapped <laughs> oh it becomes tapped again alright that's the end this is the end my only fr actually I kind of like Kira in this matchup they're targeting my stuff all day. All day. Every day. Is chicken... I think we take a nimble obstructionist. Yeah. I don't like these X1s. Every... I actually do kind of like this in here. 
Let me just add another white. Opt is pretty bad, right? Um, it's fine. It's pretty boring. I mean, but you have to cut something, so. I feel like it's opt. Josh, have a good night, buddy. Thank you so much for hanging out. Always appreciate it. Capriche. I appreciate Chicken Sunday. Do you? Do you really? I don't know, man. It's... I mean, it's every day. It so. gets a little overwhelming. Yeah, you know, I mean, it gets a little overwhelming sometimes. Yeah, well, I did promise it, though. That was, yeah, that was the uh, the platform that you ran on. I don't know, it's awkward. Every day is Michael Sunday. Is six. I don't know what that means. I like Clever Impersonator. You can copy all kinds of things. You can copy their Soren. You can copy their Lingering Souls token. You can copy a boat. I was a boat once. Yeah, that worked out. It was rough. It wasn't great. A little too wavy? It was a little too wavy. Should you chart it, of course? I'll chart your face. Doesn't make any sense. I like this Amiria Maloku combo. We bounce a land and then we replay it and we get two dudes. Ooh, that's pretty cool. I wish we had an Azusa so we can play two lands a turn. <laughs> <laughs> can you do the chicken Sunday in chicken Sunday? I don't think you can be in it. I would cut the mirror for opt. Oh, the mirror is great though. It blocks all their things. Blocks their dark confidant. It blocks their imposing sovereign. If they kill it, it does a, it does a, a, a heck it, it does a, a, what's it called? What's the, what's the word they use? I don't know what you're talking about. It does them a, what is the, in the heckin, in the heckin dog meme. Does them a bamboozle? Yeah, it does them a bamboozle. Michael B is like a child's mind trapped inside a flesh pizza. Oh my god. This is not okay. Would you call yourself a uh, flesh pizza? I would not do that. I don't know what that means. Everyone's a flesh pizza. What'd you say to me? Everyone's a flesh pizza on Chicken Sunday, which is every day. That's a fair point, I guess. He makes a valid point, guys. Look at this little idiot. Every game with this dude? That's interesting, man. I'm going to lead with this in case we get Knight of Meadow Grain. But otherwise, we're going deep on the on the plains. Also, this is a turn 4 Elder Deep Fiend when we sack our Blade Splicer. And we get to tap their City of Brass to make it deal them a damage. Got him. God, they're confident on every game, too. Unbelievable, man. Why didn't they attack there? Condemn? That's interesting. Can you take the label off your Mountain Dew so it's actually invisible? Yeah, I probably could do that, actually. Go and we'll clip it. I hope this, all this crinkling isn't triggering you guys' ASMR. They might be into it. <laughs> That's true. That's true. That one part you can't get off. Don't even try. Yeah, this is... Yeah, that's... Why would you attack with this guy but not this guy? I don't understand. Is it super... Is it truly invisible? Wow. Other than the... um, That's weird because if I hold it like this, there's no label. And then the label comes out of nowhere. That's... My God. What a time to be alive. So much power. Now you're playing with power. Nintendo the power. The Orange Mountain Dew is the best live wire. Isn't that not around anymore? There's a lot of Mountain Dews that aren't around anymore. Back in my day. They just came out with Mountain Dew Ice. I haven't tried it yet. You know who else came out with Mountain Dew Ice? No. My dad. I don't think he did. I think you're lying. Can you prove it? No, not yet. Oh, I'm on the, But I'm on the case. Okay, as long as... Detective Barbobliboo is on the case. Yeah, I think you know, boy. I don't think any of us have anything and, to worry about. Of course, my sidekick, Lil Boofy. Uh, Lil Boofy's in prison. He's the last person that's going to be working. Yeah, but on he a was case. framed. I'm getting him out. You were on two cases. Yeah. I never stopped the grind, boy. <laughs> oh, they're actually this is the only white mana they have. That's interesting. 
Anyone know of a cure for hiccups? 30 minutes now? Wow, 30 minutes of hiccups? That sounds miserable. Mother of God. I put my back up, put my back up against the wall. I was not impressed with Mountain Dew Ice. What does it taste like? Is it just like Sprite? Ice, ice, baby. Mountain Dew Ice, Ice, baby. You haven't attacked them in there at 12. Seems good, yeah. They also have a damn a dismember in hand, so that could even be some more, some more valuable love. Come on, valuable love. Is I'm really tempted to uh, tap down everything they own. But Anyone know a cure for crippling depression 10 years now? <laughs> um, <laughs> oh, God, Sovereign, it just got real. I would recommend seeing a doctor if you've had crippling depression for 10 years. It might be time. It's probably, I think it's, it's probably a chemical imbalance. I think it's, it's probably time. I mean, I'm not, I'm not some guy that likes to go to the doctor often, but... Uh, Mike's no doctor. Why doesn't breakfast pizza exist where the crust is like a pancake and there is bacon? Um, hmm. You know, I don't know. So like a pancake with like eggs and bacon on it? And cheese? Make a bacon pancakes, pancakes. That sounds all right. Have you tried just like being happy? Solid choice. Put a pray counter, huh? You've got to pray. Pray, pray, pray. You've got to pray. Put a pray counter today. You're going to pray on both my guys? That's rude. You are not a nice person. Pray on, boy. Nothing, huh? <laughs> One, two, three, four. Oh, they didn't add mana. That's pretty good. Hey, <laughs> You can also deal eight to their face. <laughs> yeah, but you can get the Soren off the board. You're right. Well, I mean, they could... Yeah. We could put it to two, I think, because they did, they do have a dismember. So they're probably going to dismember this guy. Can we substitute a waffle instead of a pancake so I can have deep dish breakfast pizza? Yeah. Ain't nobody stopping you. Stopping you. Why both of Soren? Uh, because they're going to dismember... If we just attack with this guy, they dismember it just to keep Soren alive. Oh. And it takes none. If we attack with both, they can dismember here still. And Soren goes to two. Oh, Slaughter Pact. Well, that's hmm. unfortunate. It is unfortunate. Wish I had a thing to do about that. A thing to do about that. And they dismember? Good lord. Do you really want to dismember the guy that you already put a prey counter on? I guess so. All right. <clears throat> I think we're just going to Maloku here. Next turn, we can just make a million dudes. We're starting every land we have. <laughs> One time I made French toast with waffles. What does that even mean? You know what it means. I don't, actually. I, I wish, I, why couldn't they just reel Tetsamok off of their 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 dark confidant? French toast with waffles. You dip the waffle in egg. And then you cook oh. it like that. Okay. At least that would be my guess. Yeah, I bet that was pretty good. Ooh! Ooh! There are five. And they have a Dark Confident and a City of Brass on board. That's pretty good. We just gotta survive. I mean, we're at 18, so... Freedom Toast. They do have some life gain, though. Oh my god. I mean, we can bounce one of the vampires. We also have Colonnade, too, so... We can bounce one of them vampires. But I filled the waffle with cream cheese first? That's weird unless it's, like, sweetened cream cheese. I assume it was. I would hope so. If it's just, like, regular cream cheese, then you're getting that real weird. That would be weird. That would be weird. Hmm. 
Believe it or not, I will probably never kill your Dark Confidant if I don't have to. We've got two prey. Are we going to win this match? That'd be pretty Maybe. sweet, right? Oh, I, I like winning. You got a thing? Sl Post combat slaughter pack, so you don't gain the life. And you go to four because you took one from Caves of Koilos. Interesting. But if you killed it, you could have just drawn a card. You could have gained a life. Are you just dead to this? No, you go to three, I guess. Does that do anything? No, not really. So you just tap it with this idiot. But then you, like, it puts you on having to have this, but it also doesn't... Hmm. Hmm. Is it just Elspeth make a bunch of dudes? It's got to be Elspeth Probably, make a bunch yeah. of dudes. Just hit a card that costs four or more one time. You also have four minutes and 58 seconds. We have uh, like 11 minutes, so. Here we go. One time. Oh my oh. god! What are you doing with this Dark Confident in your deck, man? That's amazing, dude. Woo! That was gas. That was only the first match? Yeah. Jesus. I know. <laughs> That's how I was feeling. I was like, oh my god, this is still my I gotta go, guys. I gotta get out of here. I'm, See, ki I'm kidding. You gotta wake up at 3 tomorrow, man. No, you gotta wake up early because you gotta take me to the airport, but... Yeah, I'm going straight back to bed after that, boy. Yeah, well, you get to. I don't, so... Also, why'd you have to draft a slow deck, man? Sorry, I should have drafted the mono red. Yeah, you probably should have, but you couldn't resist the, tempta the temptation of the... The, the counter spell, the blue-white Cheons. I mean, we saw 4-drop, four 4-drop, four 5-drop, 6-drop in the opponent's deck, at least... Oh, uh, I'm going to go to Arkansas, Brian. Um, the game store online, uh, which is Brian, uh, invited me to come pre-release with him this weekend. So we're going to do that. When you get back? When? Yeah. Uh, I get back Monday. Short trip. It is a short trip. You're right. First pick Hornet Recruit really put us into blue-white, so he kind of had to draft this slow deck. <laughs> Mike B., what is your laziest achievement? I mean, I slept till 5 p.m. once, so that's probably it. I mean, that that, that really defeats his 4 p.m. that he does on a regular basis, so sometimes you just I'll gotta... have you know I regularly get up between 2 and 3 p.m., good sir. It's really sad, guys. Can we have an intervention for Mike? <laughs> Intervention for what? Uh, Turn for, down for what? How about for that? For your lazy lifestyle, my friend. I don't like being lazy. Why? I don't know. It suits me. No, it doesn't. <laughs> it doesn't mean it suits you because you do it. Right. Oh, my God. You're so hard to talk to sometimes. I love you, but you're hard to talk to. Look at this Shivan Reef breeding pool. They got the Alpha Verdant Catacombs. What time do you go to sleep? Tuesday? That's a good question. Wow, the old breeding pool Shivan Reef Swamp. What is even happening right I now? I'm going to go to sleep like 4 a.m. So he's only getting 12 hours of sleep, guys. It's not unreasonable. <laughs> Woo. Hmm. I kind of like upkeep Pilgrim's Eye, tap all your things. Or uh, Deep Fiend, rather. But I also kind of like wait one turn, sacrifice. Oh, rocks, paper, scissors. Been watching while I prepare for orchestra auditions. Want a pro, want a position with the Colorado Springs Pro Whoa, that's amazing. Thanks to you and Mike to keeping me laughing through this stressful three-month conflict. That's amazing, dude. Congratulations. The Colorado Springs Philharmonic sounds incredible. What a... Sounds legit. That's awesome, dude. Congrats. What do you play? What do you play? That's a great question, actually. I am going to upkeep this guy. God, I hope he says the triangle. 
Please say triangle. Please say triangle. Please say triangle. It's not a thing, right? They play other things. There's no one who just plays a triangle, right? Yes, no one just plays triangle. I assume. But boy, do, am I going to feel dumb if you actually do play the triangle and people just play triangle. All of it's those like, things. It's like, how dare you? you? You do not know the compl- the complicacies of... The what? The complicacies? You play viola? Oh, I actually used to play the viola. Did you wow. really? Yeah. In uh, in middle school and a bit of high school. God, look, how, look at the well-adjusted person you became. See, this is actually great, because now we can go Gilded Lotus and still keep up Nimble Obstructionist and Opt. We can opt to keep it up. Keep it up. Keep dip. And I'm going to keep dip. Dip, 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 dip. Everyone likes the violin. I'm like, nah, man, viola. I wonder if we can... wonder if we Nimble Obstructionist our Verdant Catacomb here. What do you think about that? It's like stifling their land, right? Oh, that's so great. Look at that. Ooh. Dirty. It's also turned... F- All right, so they have a land, but they don't have a sixth land. So that's... Or they don't have a fifth land, rather. Man, we just stifled their land. This is like legacy, bro. That's crazy. I think the only reason I played the viola was because the violin was, like, way too tiny for me. Huh. Huh. I think your mouths have started to eat themselves. I have no idea what that's in reference to. But Sounds terrifying. I agree. I got a fever, and the only prescription is one triangle. <laughs> I, I understood that reference. Mike B went fio- from violist to sleep artist. Oh, what did you hit? Simic sign. Oh, you just you plus two and Simic signated. Simic signated. Battle ball. So sovereign. In case you were curious, we missed a land drop, but we still get to play Battle Sphere or Elspeth here. So that's kind of what. Probably battle uh, ball. What? Probably Battle ball. I agree with you. Do 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 Burn dun 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 dun. Doesn't matter what comes, fresh goes better in life. With mere battle sphere of life, nothing gets to you. But Mike B is cool. He's not that cool. Wow. He's, he's kind of a nerd. Wow. You can do that in modern hurtful. for two mana. <laughs> Whatever, sovereign. I don't need your sass. You can do what in modern for two mana? Uh. I think play Battle Ball. Oh, yeah. Modern's a heck of a drug. Is this, where you want to, this is what you want to do with your life? Oh, that's really good. Oh, actually, I got I to gotta do it over here. Wow, that's going to be hard to get used to. Now you have to... You can't... You don't, you don't name it the player and redirect. You actually just put it to Chandra. One time I won the gold Olympic medal for sleep as well, and then I woke up and I was like, dang it. So far dang, from victory. Dang, nabbit. Wow. Hello, buddy. This is a good combination. I'm going to opt here. I guess we'll wait until the end of the turn. Erdathor, thank you so much for the donation. Really appreciate it. Thank you, buddy. One time I took Lunesta, but instead of making me sleep, it just gave me waking dreams, and I had a mild psychotic episode. True story. Where were you last turn? Sounds fun. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Bottom. Oh, um, dang it. <laughs> dang it. Dang it. Dang it. Oh, shucks. Bug biscuits. Elspeth is not good here. I mean, we can kill the Inferno Titan. Oh, yeah. I mean, they, I they get to kill Elspeth, but. Wait, hold on. No, they don't get to kill anymore. Torch of Defiance deals two damage to each opponent. They can't redirect it anymore. Really? Yeah, you have to deal to, to Planeswalkers. That changes the effect of so many cards. Wait, there's like a rules changing they did? Yes, there's a rules change because now you can target Planeswalkers. So like a Lightning Bolt says deal three damage to any target. 
Mm-hmm. So now you just deal it directly to the planeswalker. Mm-hmm. So things like this can't be redirected. Oh, they, really? Yeah, they just have to target a planeswalker or they don't. Interesting. Oh my god. That's an interesting change. Because it's so much more it makes more so much more sense. Like it shouldn't say uh target a planeswalker, you know, like you shouldn't have to redirect it, right? Cuz that's weird. Oh my god, that's so good. Oh, I didn't expect her to survive this. Oh wow. I am flabbergasted right now at that. I totally didn't even realize that was going to happen, you know what I mean? Yeah. I just expected her to die from the the Chandra ability. That is so good. Let's make it the guys. Reveal it to hand. Oh, clever impersonator? How many planeswalkers do we get? I'll take the clever impersonator, pal. No big deal. Just got paid a few days ago. Just want to show it. Thank you so much, man. Erdler, thank you so much. I really appreciate it. That is awesome. You are why, you are why I keep doing this, buddy. Oh, there you go. That makes more sense. I will choose pile one. Goodbye, colonnade. Goodbye, bye, little colonnade. Five thousand candles in the wind. Oh, you're gonna counter this. You got you have, you have sensor. That's gonna be so good if you have it. I'm so proud of you. Oh, okay, that's fine. That's better than sensor. Feel less got. I, I feel less got, right. I feel like you got rid of a card that had another use, so you had to give something up by, by countering this spell. That's really good. Hmm. But wait, what does Bonfire read? Does it read player? I don't know. Can you explain that anymore? What was the change? Uh, I'm pretty sure you can't redirect to Planeswalkers anymore. You just have to direct it at them. So if it says Excel the top card elaborate, you may have it. it. It deals two damage to each opponent. It actually has to deal it to the opponent. Because you don't redirect to Planeswalkers anymore. It just has to be dealt directly to them. So it makes some cards worse. Where's the damn... All right. Oh, t- oh see this? See, like, Bonfire changed. It deals X damage to target player or planeswalker and each creature that player or planeswalker's controller controls. That's a different wording, whereas Chandra does not have that wording. Does Bonfire originally read that? No. Or is it modified? (coughs) Bonfire originally says deals X damage to target player and each creature he or she controls. Hmm. That's weird that Bonfire's wording now includes planeswalkers, but Chandra's doesn't. Why is that? That's got to be confusing for which cards are reworded and which ones aren't. What's a witch card? You know, I guess spooky card. <laughs> I see. Bye, bye, little Michael Barbable Boo. You're just 5,000 candles in the wind. Uh, what are we going to do? Pay three. Didn't I just... Why is, this is tapped. It's telling me to pay three. Uh, huh. Pay, that doesn't cost six, right? There's no, like, there's no trick here, right? God, they still have three cards in hand. God, Supreme so is good. So now you have to look up whether cards that can target Planeswalkers or not? That's weird, oh, right? so annoying. Why did Why some cards get that? eroded? Oh, Chandra's plus ability doesn't... Oh. It doesn't target. Right. Okay. Oh, because it deals damage to each opponent. So the alternative would be each planeswalker. That makes sense, but it's still it's still a little confusing. That is a little confusing. <laughs> it's good times, man. Was this one? Did you see this one? No. I don't, did he change anything on that card? <laughs> I, I didn't see any change. Oh, Forked Bolt's a good one. They said all burn spells. What does this say? 
Two damage among any two targets. Any one or two targets. So they can actually choose Jace and our Thank face, you. which is interesting. A little confusing. Is that little Boofy's friend? <laughs> yes. Yeah, they're in uh, they're in the same cell block, so. Cell block B. Represent. Violated Gorilla, thank you so much for the sub. Welcome to the Salt High Brood. Really appreciate it. Oh, one and one, eh? Interesting. Why is my golem getting a dealt damage? You gotta... Should have dealt one to his hornet nest. I'll deal one to your hornet nest. That's rude, man. Get wrecked. Thought we were friends. We'll never, I'll never be your friend. Well, then. Not with your attitude. I see. Three, two, one. That's pretty good. You're doing well for yourself right now. I felt like I was in really good shape before. Now I don't know what happened. He did a thing. Yep, that is that is correct. Just crack it now. Oh yeah, hundred yeah, percent. Oh, what does that get us? Uh, what do we got here? Opt. That's not very good. <laughs> That's not very good. Now is it? In it. No, it didn't. It didn't. In it. No, it didn't. In it. It didn't. Oh boy, are you weird? God, are you weird? Yeah, if we played Elspeth instead of Blast, instead of uh, Mirror Battle Sphere that turn, I think it would have been better. Carpluzen Forest. Okay, that's nothing. God, I have four cards in hand still. Just five little boofies in the wind. Oh, he's in the wind now? Where do you Get put out? your little Boofy? You break out of jail? <laughs> I'm sorry. Boofy's in the wind, guys. He got the jump on us. Little Boofy, no. They have four cards, man. They're looking at our graveyard like, what are they, they going to get back? An opt? The answer is yes. Joke's on you. It's going to be a cryptic command. Oh, I'll keep that on top. <laughs> hey look even the land for it oh no we're attacking first bye bye little boofy it's gonna be bad when they kill this mid combat and then block and get two bees I don't like this. I'm not a fan. I'm uncomfortable. Oh, it's so bad. Why can't I just have Cryptic in hand instead of Charter Course? Maybe I should have just played it first. This is so greedy. What is this? 10 mana? Oh, brother. Oh, brother. They don't actually have an instinct to get back. Oh, they have Supreme Will, I guess. Yeah, it's actually, this is all fine. This is much worse. This is much better than I, I was expecting. I was expecting to kill this, get two bees. Get their hornet nest back. Yeah, this is alright. I often forget the Torrential Gear Hulk can't get back sorceries. He'd be a lot better if he could. Perfect draw. Outstanding. I don't feel like we're in good shape here, I'll be honest with you. No? Correct. Two Bs or not two Bs? You're still not in a good spot. I, uh, I agree with you. It's that time of the month where all the, uh, the Twitch Prime subs begin expiring, so like... I'll get like a bunch of new subs and then it won't actually move the needle. So it doesn't seem like I got a bunch of new subs and I'm like, wait, didn't I get like four in the last hour or so? And then, then it's like, oh, well, I guess they're not there anymore. Dang it. Why do you have to have that? It's so, yeah, it's frustrating, but I can see it makes sense. If the only way you could continue playing magic was to be a beekeeper by day and sleep 12 hours at night, would you do it or quit magic? Um, Where's the time for the rest of the stuff? I could... <laughs> Why would I have to sleep 12 hours a night? That's interesting. I mean, I'd probably do it for a little while because beekeeping actually sounds pretty sweet. 
I mean, we're not talking about like gross wasps and hornets. We're talking about bumblebees, which are cool. Bumblebees. Bumblebeesies. Bumblebeesies. Yeah, this game's over. The card advantage is too great. Yeah, that's not going to do it. They're too strong. I'm boarding this guy. Yeah, man. No way, bro. Board him into the trash can. Hmm, board him into the trash can. I didn't consider that, actually. Yep. No, you didn't. How did they kill our Elder Deep Fiend again? Chocolate. <laughs> oh, chocolate. I hadn't considered that. Amped 100 bits. Thank you so much, buddy. Appreciate you. I don't know what to do. Didn't they, um... Kira? Oh, Kira seems great here. Blasphemous Act? Was that it? What did you just say? Yeah, they had Blasphemous Act, but we just have to hope they, we can counter it. And we'll not overextend into it, I guess. We're just 5,000 Kiras in the wind. I think I thought this here. God, every time. Hmm. Keeps. Got that turn one opt boy. What's an opt boy? You know what I'm saying. He brings you stuff. What'd you say to me? He brings you stuff. He brings your stuff, my opt yeah. boy? Yeah. How does that even make sense? He's an opt boy. So let's go we have seventeen lands. I don't we don't need more lands, that's for sure. It's not like we're playing less lands because we have Gilded Lotus. Oh, I'm actually gonna keep you on top because we need you. But then it's gonna be another island, so it doesn't matter. Oh, it wasn't another was a cryptic command that's so much better than an island that's like an island but uh, if an island did cool stuff on 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 drugs i mean it's not that good if we don't draw another island Risa for the resub thank you so much really appreciate it i think this was a preemptive prime resub it said my sub expired on the second on the 21st happy chicken so oh that's sad our opponent despite being a big fan is pretty rude <laughs> Because they're winning the game? That's correct. Man, how rude of them. I agree with you. We're just 5,000 candles in the wind. Oh, man, Cohen Brothers is part of my... What did what just happen? Mm. Leonard Cohen or Cohen Brothers? I appreciate both, but Cohen Brothers. The Big, the big Lebowski was a big, a big part of my life back when I was in uh, uh, early 2000s, I guess. Late... Late, late aughts, late teens. No, neither of those are correct. Ignore what I'm saying. I always do that. God, you're the best. <laughs> and the worst. You're actually terrible. Well, this is a real, this is a real grind fest here. Or, or this is a real Rick grime fest. <laughs> <laughs> you have to blame Mike if you lose. It's literally all his fault. Boy, you don't have to tell me twice. He was going to do that anyway. This is really Supreme Will. <laughs> I just don't have anything to play, man. I'm sorry. I don't know what to tell you. I like that this this FTL lull icon emo, emo, emoticon has been used uh, pretty... Uh, you can have that. I don't care what? about It's for two. Oh. They Sphinx Ref for two. I'm just going to give it to them. It's a divination. It's a five-mana divination. They can have it. They gained two life, man. Yeah. I'll, I'll allow We're it. We're going to die now. Yeah, that spell it was some winning when they had 22 life. God, that's the worst one. I bought my brother the Big Lebowski Collector's Edition that came with a mouse pad that looked like the rug from the movie. It didn't really tie his desk together. If you could have Tarantino direct any film, what would it be? Ooh, that's a great question. Wow. How about Michael Mann's Heat? I would like to see Michael Mann's Heat directed by Quentin Tarantino. I think this has to be countered, right? Yeah. And they're just going to counter back with their negate. Probably. We can get around Rune Snag. We can get around Sensor. We can uh, just win that counter spell battle, I guess. Just 5,000 candles in the wind. Oof. This is a good. This is a good split here. The Notebook. Oh my God. <laughs> That's gas. Uh, we'll take this one. That would be an interesting change to that movie. I like Deep Fiend here. Once again. 
Deep Fiend under this card is gasoline. Our hand is great. They're going to play a big Planeswalker here like an Elspeth or a Soren, and we're going to feel bad, but... Yeah, it's life, you know? Sometimes they're going to be clever impersonator it because they're going to tap out to do it. Or they have... Don't they have Inferno Titan, too? God, that card's a good card, too. Finding Nemo, directed by Quentin Tarantino. How would he slip his foot fetish in? <laughs> Does he do that? Is that like a thing uh, it's, it turns into a fin fetish, I think. So. Is that like a secret of his movies? Oh, I want to copy that. Can you copy that? Yeah, it's a non-land permanent. Oh. You don't know how Karanos works? Bwah! Or not Karanos, Clever Impersonator. I'd like to see him direct Event Horizon. Hmm. Plus we got four pips. Four pip 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 pips. I'm just going to bolt our Jace. Now they reel the land, so get wrecked. Jace gets to live again, and we get to draw two cards with, the, with our Jace. Isn't Event Horizon about that weird movie on that ship? <sighs> it's about your mom, Michael. Oh. Okay, weird movie about a ship. Go ahead. And there's like portals of demons and stuff? That sounds correct. Nemo works as one of those fish that he dead skin off people's feet. <laughs> oh, God. What is this chat even, man? Oh, Lord. We're having a good time. God, is this guy a thing we want to resolve? Not really. I gotta try, right? They're gonna have Supreme Will, but... Oh, it's so brutal. Bant Charm. Wow. I mean, if they kill Jace, like, we just get to Karanos it, ideally. And Jace is really a liability at this point anyway, so... Alright, Planeswalker versus Planeswalker. I win. <laughs> so we can play this guy. And assume you Blasphemous Act, right? Blasphemous Act's cost. Oh, Soren. There's the Soren. There it is. So they played a breeding pool. Um. So Blasphemous Act costs what? Nine or 13? What does that card cost? Like it's like a lot of mana. Nine. So it costs five mana. One, two, three, four, five. So they'd have two up. Now a Rex Age. It's God, pretty good. That's rude. So now you have Soren in hand. Man, the Battle of the Karanoses is pretty good. Where did one of our guys go? Oh, did they bolt one of the guys instead? God, draw two cards a turn. What a time to be alive. I think we just gathered up this guy. Um, no, we don't want you to replay it, I guess. So we get to draw two off Charter Course and play uh, Elder Deep Fiend and get rid of your Soren all in the same turn. Seems pretty good. Take a look. It's in a book. Oh, Cryptic Command? Boy. Boy. Boy, I tell you what. Do you tell me what? There's a Blasphemous Act. All right, well, we're going to tap all your things down. I can do anything. Let's tap all of your things down. We know two of your five cards. One, two, three, four. Blast sex cost five, so you're not going to be able to play without two mana. Am I missing anything in the chat here? Hmm. -mm. 
What are some of the best sci-fi movies? Let's talk about that. One of my favorite sci-fi movies is Moon. It's a good one. I know. Oh, they could still have Supreme Will. But if they get it, if we get it out of their hands, Snapcaster and Cryptic is much better. So, oh well, I guess we get to find out. Oh, then after midnight. I'm also a big Interstellar fan. We got Soren Lignify, which I'm not too concerned with. Uh, Flame Slash Electrolyze. It's either Blasphemous. I think it's Soren. Um, so Flame Electro Lignify Blasph. And we're just taking the Soren. They do have electrolyzed mana, which is nice for them. <laughs> okay, well, that's not great, but the problem is we want to keep up Snapcaster. And if we counter the electrolyze, we can't do that. Yeah, this is electrolyzed, electrolyzed, which I guess is fine. We just go electrolyze, electrolyze, lignify. Actually, we could actually bounce our own Vendillion click and then just replay it. And then just respond by killing it. Oh, yeah, that's a good point. I forgot about that. Well, I went to 11 here. So we have three guys, so this costs six. One, two, three, four, five, six. I don't want to play this because then it costs five, which means if they have land, other thing. Yeah, I'm just going to electrolyze and then lignify. Electrolyze and lignify. God, I'm real tempted to counter it, but then they just blast from a sack. Yep. That is what it is. Tireless Tracker. Oh, I went through the face there? Because you could have Flame Slashed this guy, which is pretty good. I think we actually have to kill Tireless. Actually, we don't because we have a Karanos of our own. God, this game's... You drafted like the most dirtily deck. Yeah. You're like, let me draft the deck that's going to take the longest amount of time. Well, I wanted the cube to last. I know. You just got to prolong it. I thought I was going to get some good sleep tonight. Nope. Joke's on you. Joke is on me. Funny joke. Funny joke. It was not, but it was twas not a funny joke. I thought it was. I thought it was. Actually, we have Sower. We can steal this. That's pretty good. Wow. You drew Verdant Catacombs, huh? That's pretty good. That was your, your two cards you've drawn are Tireless Tracker Verdant Catacombs. That is pretty good. Impressive. Most impressive. I like that because now we can actually either adept our Elder Deep Fiend. I'm not chiming in on the sci-fi discussion. I didn't I mention it? Yeah, you said moon. I said moon and, and interstellar. I'm a big fan of those. And then I was trying to concentrate on this game because there's a lot going on. My bad, Resif. Well, that's not a lightning bolt. Elspeth. It was another land. That's unfortunate. Rocking out to midnight. I also like being able to sack this either add up to the Acceler Deep Fiend. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ba -do -ba -do -do. God, 
God, this game is grindy. We have 11 minutes. They have 8 minutes. So that's pretty okay. We'll get there. Cone of Flame. That's rude. Uh, tap, 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 tap. So in your hand is Blast Impact, Cone of Flame, oh, Flame Slash. Two other cards, I guess. One you drop this. All right, I like it. Can we just kill them? Is it possible? Three to the dome. Oh, that's pretty good. Is it? You only have one red, so Blast Sack doesn't really do much. It costs six mana, you got five. You die? Yeah, I'm dying. That's unfortunate. Of oh, deadly death disease. God, I knew you had the deadly death disease. <laughs> Should have invited you into my home. So Cone of Flame, Blast Sack, Flame Slash, all of which are sorceries, which is good. I wonder if we just run out Snapcaster if they have any consequences for that. What do you do? Five, six, seven, eight. If this is a bolt, we can kill them. Well, they have a blocker still. Well, now we can sower it. Seven, eight, nine. It's nine damage. Den Protector. Okay. It's actually very good with your assortment of cards in your graveyard. Okay, well, never never lightning bolts. That's not bad. I'd say it's Dece. I'd say it's a funny joke. Hmm. Funny joke. One, two, four, one, two, three. Give me that clue. They are as empty as my clue seems to be. What do you get out of your graveyard? It stinks as rev? That's pretty good. I mean, thankfully I got this this bad Larry in hand. Geist was lethal, by the way? What does that mean? I have no idea what that means. always forget no we can't this is one two three four five six if we have snapcaster too i mean they they block here or they, they would block the care now so they take five six seven eight that's not lethal and then like we don't have any protection for the next turn blasphemous act which resets the entire board right I mean, I guess they can't get this guy off the board without dying, but they're just getting Sphinx's Revelation back because it's a Den Protector. Yeah, we take one, Geist taps the other one, right. So, oh, they don't block. That's a good point. Yeah, that's interesting. I see what you said there. What did they get back? Band Charm? Oh, so they can Blasphemous Act and... You know what? I don't know what they're doing. And keep Band Charm up, I guess. God, Supreme Will 2? Ooh. All right, so we have Blasphemous Act, we know. Flame Slash. 
and Bant Charm. Charm. So we know five of the six cards in your hand. That's actually pretty okay. No one knows what it's like to be Michael Barbably Boo. To be the Barbably Boo. Telling Barbably Blies. Wow. Amazing. Was it? Huh? You said amazing. It was. It was amazing. So only two of the cards in your hand are instants. We can go one, two, one, two, three, four, Snapcaster, Cryptic Command, and we can still pay for Supreme Will. So you're going to try to Bant Charm, but we're going to Snapcaster Cryptic, you're going to Supreme Will, and then you're going to die. Then you're going to die. Let me crack their clue. Deal. D -d 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 Deal there. So you can put this guy on the bottom. We're going to go, nah. I will not allow it. I'll choose cryptic command. If you want a supreme will, I will pay. Blant charm is gone and the game has ended. Ooh, the grind is so real, guys. Got him. Is this has this been any good? I don't think so, right? No. The only thing they have is Karanos, and that's a dude I really don't feel like dealing with. But boy. It's also indestructible, so you can't. Correct. Copying Karanos. That's a, that's, a, that's a pretty good. That's a pretty good. Like, all of our cards that make extra cards. Actually, maybe Mimic Vat comes in. If they yeah, want to. pretty grindy. If they want to. Yeah, and also if they want to Massacre. Uh, if they want to Blasphemous Act. Maybe that's where we want to be. What are we taking out here? Perilous mirror? Probably. Yeah, that guy seems pretty sad. What a sad little mirror. All right, they also have five minutes to win, and we have eight minutes. So we just play fast, and we should be able to keep it. Keep it. Keep it, 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 keep why do you why do you always have to ruin everything I say? Someone has to. God, you're right. Alright, lands. That's enough. That's enough, lands. Oh, let's go with this one. Clever impersonator is good, but it's only as good as the best card, and I have a feeling Elspeth might be the better card. We'll see. Do we run out Blade Splicer or do we keep up disallow? Probably keep up disallow. Um yeah, because Chandra. Yeah. Also, if we just prolong the game and actually play any threats, like, we kind of do. Okay. Right, like, yeah, and if we can go Blade Splicer, keep up, disallow, even better. Oh, the white man, eh? All these reactive creatures we got here. I need you to play things so that I can return them to your hand. They're not going to do it, though. Don't deny me. My little blade splicey boy. First play of the game. What do we see? We saw Essence Scatter and we saw Supreme Will and Bant Charm, but that doesn't counter a creature, so. First blood. Got him. Now we have four minutes more, so. I don't know if they can win this these grind this grindy match. I don't know if they can win it in four minutes, three minutes, but we'll see.
Oh no. Oh god, never. Oh boy. That was a real hold on to your butt situation. Did I, not, did I wait? What? One, two, three, four, five. Sure. Let's eight you. Yeah, it's hard to just play Pilgrim's Eye, so. Well, your opponent got about three minutes, three minutes of play. Time. What does that mean? You. What are you saying, Juposhi? Yep, that is a one for one. And this will be a two for two for two. No, it's a two for one. One blade splicer for a fork bolt and a magma jet. That is a good value for me. It's all right. <laughs> How is it not good? Because we like having a creature. Well, they kept Bant Charm mana up, so we're just gonna play a Vendillion click on your on your draw step. And now their electrolyze is gonna be real good, but what are you gonna do? We can get rid of the Inferno Titan at least. Oh, Supreme Will. Fascinating. No, oh, Essence Scatter. Deal. So like jokes on you, I drew that. <laughs> are you gonna kill my what? Really? Oh, you had a flame slash. That's aggressive. Hmm. Oh, this is awkward. Why? Because of our two dudes. Yeah. I mean, in two turns, we could just cast Elspeth for free and put Chandra to one. Seems fine. Cone of Flame. <laughs> yeah, do that. <laughs> they have two cards? I feel confident with what we have. Inferno Titan. Soren. Ooh, that's a good dude. Soren and doo doo. Mountain in your hand. Sounds good. <laughs> Soren in. Did you say your doo doo? I just said Soren and doo doo. Hmm. You didn't say Soren and your doo doo? No. Eh, we'll kill Chandra. All right, we'll take three. You have Electrolyze and Mountain in hand. What did you play? Forest? Hmm. Did you play the Mountain last turn? No. Okay. So we know you have Mountain and Electrolyze in hand. Soren's a bit scary. Really? Mm-hmm. Have, we have two of the three cards in their hand. Well, just as random reveals could kill us. I mean, we're at 15. The funny thing is we probably could just kill them with Colony, but then, like, we give them a million activations of the Planeswalkers, so... Shivan Reef. We're doing we're doing alright. Alright, Reef is gone. Reefies PCs. <laughs> what does that kill? Mimic Vat? Yeah, it's fine. Sure. See, I'm pretty sure Soren dies here. They electrolyze two, they block one. Soren goes Ah, Soren goes to one. Actually we can bounce the Reclamation Sage and try to kill Soren here. Seems better. We know they have two cards, so. Mm-hmm. 
Soaring and doo doo. Doo 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 doo. -do. That's actually pretty okay here. Because it cycles? Well, no, because like they have three mana. So if they have, the, if they want to like play a three mana spell like a Supreme Will. Then uh, we just get to. I just want to take out all their threats. This guy's gone. Soren, Soren. I mean, it does cycle though. Yes, that is a a viable use. Oh, be a three mana spell. Oh, they're just cycling. Oh, their own cycling. Kerwin, have a good night, buddy. Thank you for the, the, the support tonight. Really appreciate it. So you know they have just a mountain in hand. I don't think they can win in 58 seconds, but... You know. That was a good draw. So now they can't ban charm unless they do something else first. And I don't even care if they blasphemous act because we just get colonnade and they're at one. Wow, I think we actually just won on not time, which is pretty sweet. Dude, we're we're two well. You did you did you did all right. It's slow, but it gets the job done. <laughs> Mike, did you start the job yet? Not yet. Mike doesn't actually start till like May 7th. Correct. Which is a Star Wars reference. May the 7th be with you. That's uh that's pretty sweet. I don't think it is. That's a pretty cool coincidence, man. Good games. Unless of course they're like, here, I got I got a 15 damage spell for you. Oh, five? Oh god, what are they are they gonna kill me? Am I dead? They targeted themselves. <laughs> Classy. Classy. I am a fan. Nice. Nice. Do we just want to bring in... Do we just want Kira in the deck? It seems pretty good. We can take out Lotus and play Kira. Okay. Especially because we have Dungeon Geist and Sower. Like, I just want those creatures to live. I want them to leave. I hate you. Why? What do you mean, Why? Have you ever met yourself? Yeah, I'm the worst. It's oh, fair. boy. They could go channel Fireball. I don't think they have a channel, though, thankfully. Also, they have one life, so not ideal, but an option. An option. I don't think it's an option, actually. I don't think it's You got there, man. You got a little napkin? Mm -hmm. You still playing with your tissue? Yeah. Okay. Juposhi, we're 2 0. Why are you asking? Uh, I will keep this hand. Give me something clever. Give me something good to eat. Shell Dock Isle. You're a tasty huh. treat. Huh? Interesting. What's up? Tell me. Tell me, Michael. Tell me about your problems. That landfalls chickens on the board. It does. It does landfall some chickens on the board. I bet that sensor is getting taken. Or Perilous Mirror. Yeah, Perilous Mirror is pretty weak, though. I would not mind if you took my Perilous Mirror. Well, we no longer have any reason to uh, actually maybe we should have played, played Mindstone. I just wanted to be able to get this to block this guy but that's stupid. Like if we, if we draw like a Jace or any 4 drop I'm going to feel real stupid. That's fine. I don't care about that. Attack. No? Meh. All aggressive, you. Landfalls, chickens onto the board. That's all I want. Just some chicken landfalls. Hedron Archive. Boy, they are, they are getting their ramp arena on. Elder Deep Fiend. Pilgrim's Eye. 
Not quite the same. Similar, but different. Burr, 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 burr. One, two, three, four, five. So we'll have six mana next turn. So once we draw that, once we top deck that Elspeth, I thought you didn't like Sheldock. I, I mean, I, I never said I didn't like it. I said I don't pick it very highly because I think this cube is worse for it. Uh, if I get it in my pool and I'm playing blue, it's 100% getting played every single time. Never said I didn't like it. I said I, I think people overvalue it. Yeah, it's much better than like the Vintage Cube. Because you're just doing more more powerful things. And the, the other reason it's better in the Vintage Cube is because uh, you're it's a lot easier to go through your deck. There are a lot more cards. Uh, you're It's like we, 27 and 27 are the cards, right? Um, so it's, it's going to be seven turns before I get to play this for free. Wow, that's kind of what we were hoping for. Yeah, it's pretty good. That's, uh, that's pretty good. I mean, they have Heroes Downfall, so what are you going to do? Well, they don't have two black. Oh, yes, they do. Yeah, they're going to play a hero. It's, they, have, they have one of two hero cards. It's going to be Hero of Oxid Ridge or Hero's Downfall. Those are my guesses. One hero or another. Or Thunder My Hellkite. Good Lord, what is this? What's happening? This is six mana. It's just fireball. <laughs> oh, that's a good one. It's not great though. Um, yeah. It's not. Yeah. They could tap a blocker and make two Okay. Uh shoot you. Seems good. Counterspell of some sort. Let me tap here. Glacial Fortress? Sure. Amp, thank you so much for the bits. It's not bad. Um, yeah, that's fine. We'll just play this. We don't need the white, but I could bluff multiple counterspell arios. Chandra can negative one kill my soldiers. Yeah. It's like the universe is a simulation or something. You are not wrong. Boy, I've seen a simulation before. And they know we have a sensor, so they can't play their seven mana card this turn. Hmm. Oh, they didn't. They didn't draw their card yet. That was probably weird. just cycle the sensor. I'll cycle your face. Hmm. Got him. So you're saying we should play Magic of KFCs? Then you get some fried chicken every time you play land. Oh, uh, if you're not doing that already, it's already a misplay. Yeah, definitely. I feel like making elementals is just better, right? Because you, Chandra goes up to five instead of one. And you're still able to take out two of these guys, right? And so I'd have one elemental and a perilous mirror. Or one soldier and a perilous mirror. I don't know. Oh, you're going to tap Kira. And then you're going to shoot Kira. Okay. Oh, yeah, they tapped a guy too because they would have Icy up. Yeah. Yeah, that was what I was thinking, so. Boy. Wait, they know. Oh, that's a good one. One, two, three. Yep. That's real sad. We're definitely cycling sensor. Mike's face kind of looks like the Gerber baby. <laughs> a little bit, yeah. You got a real Gerber baby face right there. Oh, uh, she did. That's sad. Reflector Mage would be nice. I would love to put this guy back in your hand and not have you ever use him again. They, oh, they couldn't do two and one because... 
Oh, they did one to us because I think they, I think they, oh, they did one to Elspeth. Okay, never mind. I'm, I am a dummy. I really gotta get rid of this guy. God, Inferno Titan is one of the most problematic creatures in this cube, I think. Mm hmm. Sower of Temptation would be also acceptable. No, let's do it in second main. Sell your dudes. We can also crack this uh, Mind Stone as well. Probably should. Yeah, probably doing that. It's not bad. Not kind of answers it. Oh, we can also just negative Elspeth, right? Yeah, we could. That's probably what we want to do. But... Won't she die, then? Then we have the Chandra to deal with, you're right. So just keep it tabbed down with Edge, guys. Well, on the bright side, uh, no matter what, this guy's not untapping this turn. Oh, boy. Boy, what I would... What I would give for a cryptic command here. So I have two cards in hand. Hopefully they're terrible. No Blasphemous Act again. Come on. Quarantine Field. It's pretty good. It's a pretty annoying. Elspeth Dungeon Geist? Oh, God. Disenchant is definitely coming against this deck. Negative one. Okay, so that actually solves that problem. Hmm. All right, well, they're back at two cards. And we can always copy the Inferno Titan at some point. Well, that's unfortunate. God, Inferno Titan's real big, isn't it? It's yeah. real big, isn't it? So wait for it to attack so it can't kill the Vendillion Click. Then we'll just Vendillion Click and... We'll take three. We can also choose ourselves and hit the Aether Adept, but I'd rather, I think I'd rather go hit them. Every day is Chicken Sunday. Oust and Obzadat. Let's get rid of your Obzadat. <laughs> that card seems real hard to deal with. Oh, we were going to block, weren't we? Not oh. Anymore. Wow. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So they could have dealt us, could have us the four there. I guess I'm glad they didn't. Oh, here's what we're going to do. Oh, no, we can't do that. <laughs> I was going to say we're going to block here with the three and then flash this dude in. Why can't we do that? Uh, because they'll just kill it before blocks. Oh, true. True that true we can still block it though with the with their own which is actually pretty good and we know they only have oust in one of their card in hand so so they attack deal three. Oh, they do have icy though oh then we can block with snapcaster so yeah that's actually fine it's not ideal but that's pretty annoying Still gonna play it. We can actually copy their icy and tap down there. Oh, yeah, that's actually pretty good. I think I like that better. Every day.
Chicken Sunday. The problem is that um, they can just tap down ours at the end of the turn. So... Yeah, that's pretty good. We can just bounce that, though. Oh. It's not terrible. You gain three life, sure. Curve to command. Oh, that's actually great. Great. Yeah, we get two of them because it's a snap case. Oh, that's but... insane, actually. Oh, wow. That's really good. And then next turn we can... Oh, it's still bounce the hero, though. Then we just lose our Ather up to the Inferno Titan, though. Yeah. I think you're, that's probably still correct. I need a hero. So bad and do and do so bad and do skibbity do tap in my IC manipulator that's what you do I need a hero a plate hold gonna deal two and then one condemn you to the bottom of your library that's gonna be a lot of fun yep what if he's gonna pump One can only hope, Michael. Yep. Yep. It's eight. I kind of feel like you have to go for it here, right? I guess they don't think so. They disagree. Unfortunate. I was, it's just, I don't know. Whatever. I was, I'm sad that they didn't go for it, but... Did they want to cast their hero? Yeah, they do. I mean, it makes sense. Like, we have two cards. They could be anything. If you go all in, it puts you real far behind, but... Vendillion click. So I'm pretty sure we just play this during their upkeep again. Or their draw step, rather. Especially now that they can't. Inferno Titan it away. Sure. <laughs> Let's see what you got. I kill it in response. Exiled. God, you don't even gain two life from... Ah, uh, we'll get rid of the arena. <laughs> Definitely. What was the other card? Canyon Slough? Yeah. I think. Some kind of land. Some kind of way? It's gone now. <laughs> it's gone now. It has left. Stack it incorrectly. Dang it, they never do. I gained so much life. Pretty sure we're just going to block one of these guys. Snapcaster Mage ain't doing us any favors on the board. You can see that, like, what a card like Tidings or Sphinx's Revelation would do in a game like this. We would just, it would completely turn the game around. It's actually not the worst. Three. Yeah, we can just hard cast this this bad boy. Yep, you got it. I see. Tap your I see. And we're just gonna wait and eat your soldier, I guess. Yeah. 
Oh, it was hard casting an Elder Deep Fiend. Tap this idiot. And tap your black, your black, and your other black. You still have two black sources, but what are you going to do? Sure. Whatever makes you feel good. All right, now we have the 5-6 and uh, Reflector Mage. That's pretty good. We're also at a point where we can always tap their thing at the end of their turn, so. We now have the IC advantage. Yeah. Oh, that's a good one to just... The IC advantage is a real thing, man. It certainly is. Well, not anymore, I guess. So long, IC advantage. I guess we still have the IC. Why would you do that in response? Just save your time. I'm just going to run this guy out there. Like, he's at 11. Like, we have the IC advantage, right? The IC advantage. There we go. Wow. Okay. Sure, man. You got a bus. Oh, boy. This is a real thing, I guess. Wow, what are you doing here? Wow. It's a pretty good card. Crypto Command right now. Nope, just another thing. All right. We no longer have the IC advantage. Well, we could take a hit. Right, but then what's the point of that? Look, they drew a 3-3. Three, three. It's pretty good. What? Wow, we have the IC advantage again. That's great. What a dummy. Now we can just do that again next turn. I know. I don't understand what just happened. Oh, nope. Don't want you. But I guess you'll, you're you you're better. Is okay. Actually, no, it's not. That was the Elshnor on board. It's a 2-2, two -two, yeah. I don't know how to deal with this. And that's the problem. Do we have Quarantine Field in our deck? We do. Do we? Yeah. Where is it? Do we? Are you sure? Yes. No, we don't. That was the last draft. Are you sure? I'm friggin' positive, yeah. Are you sure that I'm sure that you're sure that we're sure? We, how many, we just put a land on the bottom, right? Six, seven, yeah. eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. There is one more land in our deck. And, uh... We're almost, sure, we'll draw it. Yep. Yeah. I thought we had I thought we had a good game, and then we got, uh... wreck a root, as they say. Hey, figured it out. Good for him. <laughs> good for you! I need a hero. Yeah, they have infinite cards. Wow, where did that... What? That was on the bottom of your library, though. How do you get that? Did he shuffle? I didn't see him. Oh, they Pilgrim's Eye. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shuffled Pilgrim's oh, okay. Eye. Oh, my God. They didn't attack with the Pilgrim's Eye because they think Colonnade is a 4-4. This is great news. Maybe they're just playing dumb. Do we have a day of judgment or something? Nope, that'd be good though. Only they do. They have. They only have two of them. So I draw a card, you freaking maniac. I know what's going on. You have one card in hand. Are you gonna tap down my icy? Sure. Doesn't matter. <laughs> the old upkeep tap. <laughs> That's literally wow, six. Really? Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, and we just put one on the bottom with opt. That is all the lands in the deck. Of course we drew it. That's yeah. unbelievable, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I guess we still wouldn't be dead anyway. Disenchant. <coughs> Fellow droid, what's going on, buddy? I played Spoiled the Vault searching for Ad Nauseam, having 15 life and lose the suicide. Way to combo. I guess I'll just keep going. I haven't found it yet. All right. Nice. I take out Opt. I think it's probably one of the weaker cards. Would you say you'd opt out of it? I want to bring in Maloku, because I think Maloku's actually pretty good in these longer games. Okay, watch where you're going, buddy. Why don't you do that? Stupid jerk. Did you say doo-doo? No. Okay, I'll trust you. I also got a minute and a half more. That could be relevant. 
Yeah, they have Q Field, they have Icy, they have Frexian Arena. Boy, do they have do they have targets? Was that the first game? That was game one. Okay. Dang. We're dropping a million frames right now, guys. I have no idea why. Apologies. Um, I like Sensor better than Perilous Mirror just because, and better than Opt because it's just. Interesting. Uh, because it, can, it has the potential to counter a spell, but it also just cycles. So for marginally less value than an Opt, uh, by not being able to scry, you get the ability to potentially counter a spell, which is, I think, is significantly better. But okay. I don't know if you guys ever countered spells before, but it's, it's a good feeling. Hero of Blade Hold. That's hard to deal with. Yep. Sure is. I feel regret now for not having taken this. Uh, we'll take out your IC. So we got Wrath, Day, Springs. And that's all I get to know about because I, I hate that it doesn't show you the hand. <laughs> all right. Well, this is unfortunate. Yeah, you're right. Disenchant by itself. I will take the extra, I will take the two cards. Yeah, I think we just died there. Would have got that signet? What does that mean? With what? Hero Blade Hole is such a beating. We also yep. don't really have it's pretty ridiculous. good removal for it. We can actually block it, but we take like eight. But they get a bunch of one ones, so I think we'll do that. Let's see if out of your two cards you drew something that kills this. I think going to seven here is actually fine. Because you get to do cool stuff now. Cool stuff. So you can block. I think we're actually okay here. Let's just Kira leave up sensor. Kind of like that. Not going to attack here, though. <laughs> it seems aggressive. I mean, they have Day of Judgment and Wrath of God, which is pretty unfortunate because it's going to take a lot to bait them out. Hmm. No attacks, though. God, it's going to be a sore, and we're going to be like one behind. Opposite daddy. Yeah, it is unfortunate. That is annoying. Well, we're at five. I feel like they should have attacked there. Puts us to three. Three, four, five, six. I don't know how beat that Obza dad. I mean, they have to... If we play Battle Sphere, I think they might just have to... Day of Judgment and Wrath of God. Like, we go to three... They 
can't target our things. They might just have to wrath here and kill our obs of that. It's a good value for them. But it does get rid of the obs of that. Or they're just going to play like uh, an Inferno Titan. Kill us. <laughs> That's also good. Mm -hmm. All right. That also works. All right, guys. Not too bad. Not too bad for a final modern cube uh, draft. Mike, 2-0. Uh, 2-1. Not too bad. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Thank you for the support. Uh, if you guys haven't done so, smash those like and subscribe buttons. And uh, check out my Patreon if you'd like. It is link is in the description. And it's just a great way to support the channel, either Twitch or YouTube. So I'll uh, see you guys next time with some Dominaria. Have a good night, afternoon, whatever.